Since the beginning of time, there have been people on this land, people that are more impressive than actual people, and those people are called magicians. Welcome to Magelli's Magic. Prepare to be magically amazed. What you're going to see here tonight is your mind into trepidations and make you believe things you could have never thought possible and see things you'd never think you would see with your little round eyes and your round skull. We'll start out with a little symbol trick. Assistant, will you fetch me my vase? Nothing inside it. You can see empty vase. Plain vase! Ta-da! And that's magic! They smell as fresh and sweet as a summer's day, as wonderful as an orchard that hasn't been shat in by hundreds of cows. I'm through with these wretched flowers, so let's get rid of them. On the count of three, one, a two, a three. And that, my friends, is magic. Oh, this magic. Make a girl pretty thirsty. I've got the thirst and I'm parched for a beverage. Using the power of my epic mind, I will turn this empty vase into a delicious beverage. This once empty vase has now become a vessel of liquid. Lukewarm, tepid tap water, but liquid nonetheless. I will remain refreshed and stay alive all through the power of magic. I have a five pound note, but alas, my five pound note is broken, ruined, deceased. What could I do? I could take it to the bank and ask them to switch it for a, a normal five pound note, which apparently they will do, but ain't nobody got time for that. So, using the power of magic, unlike you mere mortals stood in the bank line queue, I will automatically turn this five pound note into an actual five pound note. Ba -dum -ba -dum. -bum -bum -ba -dum. -da -ba -da -ba -da and that's why right, people I have it's a ten pound note, which is better than a five pound note and exactly what I definitely meant to happen. That's magic! I didn't came to play, I came to slay. This is my assistant, Bunny. Please give it up for Bunny. Now, as you can see, Bunny is uh, part Bunny with a humanly formed body, producing the bunny from the hat. But obviously me being a magician that's higher than most magicians, I went one step too far and I have created the human bunny. It was by accident. I didn't really know what to do with it afterwards. Normally when you pull the rabbits from the hat, you then just take them to some kind of shelter and they get rehomed to a lovely family and live out the rest of their days. But Obviously, they did not want to accept this freak of nature. So I thought, save myself some money and this could be my assistant. Now, we're gonna do quite a daring trick today. The good thing is I can do really dangerous tricks with this one and because it's not protected under any kind of animal rights or human rights, because it's somewhere in the middle, there's no risk of me ever getting in trouble. The thumb removal. I hear you gasp. I hear you scream, but do not fear, because I am so freaking magic. No need to be scared, it's a trick I've done many times before and only failed at minimal times. Ha 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 ha! Classic magician humour, I've never actually failed at anything in my life. I don't feel a thing. I'm gonna have to just slice straight through now. And as you can see, the thumb is gone. Where there was once a thumb, there's no longer a thumb. And here is said thumb. Is this really magic? I could reattach the thumb. I could just put it back on. I can magic that back on in a heartbeat. You've paid your money, you've got your ticket, and you want to see some real magic tonight. And you're about to get it. I am going to give this 
Human Bunny, a completely new thumb, because let's face it, the old one was slightly porous and it did not work that well. God, I'm going to need silence in the audience. Complete silence. Let me focus my mind. Voila! That is a thumb! It works, it's opposable, it's just as nature intended. And that, my friends, is magic. The tricks don't stop with me, my friend. They do not stop until I say stop and go home for the evening and watch Netflix. Here I have a bear, a stuffed bear. Who doesn't love a good stuffed bear? They're everybody's friend until the end. Or are they in fact just really, really pans? What I bring to the table is magic. And that magic transforms anything I want into anything I want. Or anything I don't want into anything I want. I'm using my epic magic, I'm going to turn this bear into something much, much better. That's right! I turned that, let's just put it out there, rubbish stuff bear. Crafted by the gods. The god being me. The god of magic. That's magic. You've seen some stuff here tonight. Tell your family all about it. While you're there, actually, could you also just all know that I don't need this thumb and I do need some money. So I'm willing to sell this human thumb, be a tasty snack for someone that's been thinking about trying out cannibalism. You could put it on the side when guests come over. They'll be like, why is there a thumb there? And you could say, that's the last person that didn't finish the lasagna I made. I need the cash. So I'll, I'll pop my link in an email and uh, send that through. Bunny, you've done an average to just above average job as always. Thank you, you can be gone now. We need to thank the more important people in the show. And that brings me to thanking the one person that really made this show come together. That's me. I did that. I need some coffee.